Today at Kilimani we thought we might wish to have a few words with you. And to my left is uh, Beverly. Uh, to my left is Beverly, the mother of Maxine, and uh, Marianne, her auntie. And we just want to say a few words to you because um, up until now, the whole issue, the story of Maxine has been a one-sided narrative uh, to the extent that we now have a 25-year-old 25, 25 young lady locked up in the police station and she still doesn't know what crime she has committed. Um, the emphasis today is just one message. Maxine is innocent. Maxine did not commit murder. Maxine did not commit any crime. I have just been retained. I have reviewed every single fact and all the circumstances surrounding this case. And I cannot understand how a charge of murder was preferred. But I don't want to go into the merits because the matter is now before court, except to say that we ask and we pray that the BCI and the DPP are ready with all the evidence so that the case can start as soon as possible, Thursday if possible. This is a case that should be dealt with as quickly as possible. The young lady who is now locked up has her life at a standstill. She cannot uh, carry on with her career. Her sponsors in her rallying career are withdrawing. The sooner this matter is disposed of, the better for us. Um, this morning she was taken for assessment for her mental capacity to plead. We are pleased to inform you that, of course, she is fit to plead. Of course she is fit to plead. Maxine is a normal 35-year-old, highly intelligent person who knows exactly what she's going about in her life. So, any questions? 